Hello, my friends. Today's message is going out to you on Labor Day. And tomorrow, Tuesday, we are going to be getting a new worship service. At noontime on Tuesdays, all every Tuesday leading up to the election and then following the election up to the inauguration of our next president in January, we here at St. Thomas will be leading a litany, of, litany for the elections. This meditation service time is a time just whether at work, at home, or if you can come by the church, is an opportunity to say, you know what, there's a lot of noise out there. There's a lot of stress out there. And there are a lot of people trying to divide us out there. And we as Episcopalians, we as Christians, and we as members of St. Thomas, we know better. We know how to come together in community and how through our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ to love others. That is the great commandment, and that's our invitation. Here's how it works. You go to our website or you go straight to our YouTube channel a few minutes before 12 noon. You will see um, the image of the church and you will see um, about to start. And then at 12 noon, you'll hear a welcome from someone, myself or somebody else. And then a Catherine Wright or one of our other musicians will offer a musical offering for about 10 minutes. And whether you're at work, home, or here at the church, it's just an opportunity to breathe. Breathe in, breathe out. Slow down. And then at the end of that musical meditation, I or someone else will lead us in our litany for the elections. The pastoral care team has been praying about offering this litany for almost six months now. Our vestry has been praying about this um, and has affirmed offering this. Our staff have been preparing for this as well. It's an opportunity for us to be leaders and be a beacon of hope here in the Great Bridge area, here in Chesapeake. And so we can learn from those who've gone before us how to pray for one another. So the litany is attached in a PDF file below this video that's available for you. There'll also be a link to remind you how to go straight to our YouTube channel, or there'll be also a link to go to our website if you want to go that way. At the end of the day, it's just like Sunday morning, how to watch us and participate. My hope for you is what my prayer is for me. I need to turn this off. I've gotten sucked in, especially in the last six weeks, into checking every news feed I have the app for, and checking the alerts, and seeing the minute-by-minute -minute updates all day long, and then late at night when I should be praying and going to sleep, and just being thanks for a full day, I find myself looking, ooh, what are the latest poll numbers? Who said this, and who said that, and who's in pain today, and who's rejoicing today? That's a lot of clutter. And I have to remember that actually I can let go of that. So I'm going to invite you today to join me in doing a little less of this and a little more of this. I hope you have a blessed day today. And as you're able, join us Tuesdays at 12 noon for the Litany of Elections. Peace be with you.